And now we're coming to a very important part of the show, part where, that you've been waiting for. We have a very special guest today. I will not do a, a long introduction because he has a very special introduction. Uh, so he's a great magician. <clears throat> he's from Orlando. So ladies and gentlemen, please welcome to the virtual stage, Nathan Co. Marsh. Now. One of the stars from the Penn & Teller TV series. Uh, now, he has performed all over this world. Well, he's amazed crowds of mind-blowing stunts. So dynamic. Ooh. He's groundbreaking. You know how you did that. <laughs> <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Nathan Comar. So a uh, overly dramatic uh, opening bit just for you guys. Uh, it is such a privilege to be here, Alan. This is so cool what you've created. Uh, hey guys, if you can hear me, wave your hands. Wave your, awesome, awesome, rock on. I see a couple of you I can't see waving your hands because uh, you don't have your cameras on. And that is cool, that's fine. Uh, just know that uh, what's great about this kind of medium is that it's like a show where I can see you, you can see me, we're here in the moment right now, not just watching Netflix. So I'd love you to uh, turn those on or uh, otherwise we can all just sit and wonder what's going, what, what ungodly deeds are happening behind your black screens, crazy, strange, weird things. Uh, so my name is uh, Nathan Comarsh. I'm coming to you today from Orlando, Florida. Uh, I know we have a couple, it sounded like a couple other Floridians here as well. And uh, you know us for our theme parks, lands of imagination, wonder, $17 sodas, and chafed inner thighs. But that's not what we're here to talk about, guys. Uh, we're going to start off with something I'm calling... Here's the deal, gang. So the guy, he's got the, uh, he's basically, this is a scam. It's an ancient scam. The guy, he's got uh, three bits of white cardboard that he shows you. And the objective, gang, is to watch those as closely as you can and follow uh, this guy. That's the money card. This is the sugar. It's like a guessing game, right? This is the sugar. This is the honey. This is the one that makes you money. Sometimes it creeps, sometimes it crawls. Sometimes it's not where you think at all. Watch closely. Did you guys see it go here? Did you guys see it go here? I'm, I'm only trying to help. I'm just, I'm just trying to be helpful, guys. I promise, I swear. Uh, here's the deal. It is all about focus. It's about focusing the entirety of your attention on that red X there, forgetting completely about these guys. Now some guys, and I won't, uh, I won't name names, but some people bet down here, they're disappointed. And it ain't over here, because we always keep it down here. Now, imagine for a second, ladies and gentlemen, you're 16 years old. You're walking down the midway, enjoying a chocolate ice cream cone. Your wallet is heavy from the weight of the first paycheck from the first summer job that you've just deposited. And as you walk down enjoying that chocolate ice cream, there in the distance, right at the edge of the midway, near the woods, you see a little crowd. And in the middle of that crowd is the guy. He's got gray mutton chops, silver hair there, picking his teeth with a knife between rounds. He's got a diamond ring on his people. 
And as you watch, you're following exactly where that money card is, right? You're seeing exactly where it's going. These people around you must be some dumb country bumpers because they keep losing. You're getting it right, they're getting it wrong. So you decide to venture a dollar, you decide to bet. But when you try to bet, somebody else bets $5 and the guy says he only takes the highest bet. You try to bet 10, somebody bets 20. And as you're lost in the muck, feel a little bit of that melted chocolate ice cream drip down and hits the base of your flesh. That's when I had an idea. I was going to out-hustle the hustle. This, friends, will, this adorable uh, puppy sticker right here, uh, that will represent for dramatic purposes, that will play the part of that little dab of melted chocolate ice cream. Uh, the guy, as I had the idea, I reached in, I grabbed that wad full of bills from that first summer paycheck from that first summer job. And as I went to set them on the table, I felt the bills fluttering in the July breeze. As I went to lay them down, the guy took that thick finger and he was about to write as he was about to pin those bills down, I let go. And when he turned around to grab those bills, I took just a, just a little bit, just a dab of that melted chocolate ice cream and just kind of rubbed right there. Now I'm exaggerating for you friends because you're here on camera and it'd be hard to see just a little bit, but it was very subtle as you had to know it was there, to know it was there. You dig what I'm saying. Uh, so the guy proceeded uh, not quite knowing, he went through the stuff about this is the sugar. This is the honey. This is the one that makes you money. I said, I, I don't know what got into me. I grabbed that knife. I said, freeze right there, buddy. I know for a fact that that ain't it and that ain't it. Pay up, old man. He looked at me and he said, kid. Don't you ever mess with my cards. It'll only confuse you. And then he turned over one I had just touched and that was the winner. And that's when I learned that a fool and his money were lucky to get together in the first place. All right. Coin and a mirror, a little bit of glass there. Watch closely. So what you are looking at here will give you an even better, there we go, professional show business in the 20%. We'll give you an even better view there. We'll bring down the volume on that beautiful piano music there. Uh, so what you're looking at here, gang, uh, three, uh, three coins, uh, they're about 12 inches off the surface of the table. Uh, they are resting on a 9 8 inch piece of glass, which itself is resting on some wine glasses. The goal is to get the coins from this side to that side without actually like smacking them straight through. Below, above.
I should emphasize here that it's simply a piece of glass resting on four wine glasses. Hello. Hello. Above. little penetration straight through and some of that spontaneous applause. That's incredible. All right, there we go. Well, hey, gang. Uh, good to see you guys. Uh, let me ask this as I survey across. Actually, uh, before I ask this, we are, we're closing in on the, uh, the big uh, grand finale of this little taste. Uh, if you guys are enjoying this, uh, head on over to NathanComarsh.com. We got some more details, shows, fun stuff, all that good stuff. Uh, but we're going to share one final thing with you. Uh, something that can only be described as inconceivable. I'm going to invite uh, who's got a uh, raise your hand. I can only see a few of you at this moment, but who's got a uh, wave your hands. If you've got a deck of cards, that's near you somewhere in the house. Maybe it's in a drawer. Maybe it's in by. Uh, take a moment. Uh, let me look through. Uh, Marie might. And let me grab. Let's see. Oh, did I see Lynn? Did you? Oh, Marie. Yeah, that'd be perfect, Marie. I think you're going to be amazing for this. Uh, Marie, I'm going to bring you in as we come through here. And uh, uh, hey, she appeared. Welcome. How are you? Oh, there she is. There she is. It's the mirror. Marie, good to see you. Uh, if you want to unmute yourself, uh, how are you doing this afternoon? Yes, I'm doing fine. Thank you. I was really looking forward to seeing you. Oh, I appreciate that. Oh, thank you so much. Cool, cool. I'm, I'm glad you had the chance to. Uh, Marie, let me ask you this. So you have a deck of cards near you? Uh, it's not far. Let me get it. It's out. not far. Okay, she's going to go on an epic journey for it. Yeah. As Marie does, uh, I'm going to let you guys in on a little something. What makes this uh, oh, inconceivable, shit. as it were, uh, is that you're the first audience to experience this. This is like the oh, yeah. and have seen this. Yeah. Oh, she's got, this is a, oh, cool, cool. She found them. That's awesome. That's, that's fantastic, Marie. Uh, good to see you. Cool, cool. Well, this is you got some cards. Cool. Uh, I don't know if it's a if it's a full deck or not, Marie. Uh, I'm gonna invite you, which is fine. It's okay if it's not. Uh, but these aren't like trick cards, right? Because they'll think that maybe you know it's trick magic cards. You would show show everybody, Marie. Go ahead and show them. Uh, yeah, you got it. Perfect, Marie. Yeah, good, good, good. Excellent, Marie. And and uh, so and as we go through there, cool. And let me ask you this. This is fun, brand new. Uh, we'll ask you this, Marie. Uh, I'm going to invite you to. Uh, oh, can you can you tilt your camera down? Is that possible? Is it like on a laptop or something? We're asking Marie to do a lot of manual labor here, uh, but we're going to unmute you too, Marie. I know we uh, we uh, our ninja, our tech ninjas who are amazing here, Alan. I just want to I just want to compliment the entire operation you have. They're incredible. Uh, Marie, go ahead and lower the uh, lower the lower the uh, lower the camera down for us. Oh, you're good. You're fine. You're fine. Uh, but I'm going to invite you to bring the camera down. You know how you tilt it uh, like if it's on a laptop. Perfect. And is there like a little table surface there under you, Marie? Yes. There it is. Cool. Go ahead and tilt it down. This will be easier for you if it's on the table. I promise, Marie. I promise. And here's okay. what we're going to do. I'll give you a good view too, Marie. Yeah, go ahead and tilt okay. it down so like we can see on the table. Uh, perfect. You can tilt. Yeah, just kind of tilt the camera down, Marie. I don't know how to do that. Oh, no problem. No problem. Oh, there you go. There you go. You're almost there. Almost there. Perfect. Perfect. You're doing great, Marie. Okay. That's what we're going to do. You're, you're amazing. You're incredible. Uh, you're, you're, I appreciate all the manual labor you're doing here for this magic. It's going to be great. Uh, Marie, I'm going to invite you to pick the cards up in your hand. Mm -hmm. Excellent. And what you're going to do, Marie, is onto the table, one by one, you're going to deal those cards face up, stopping whenever you would like, Marie. It's entirely okay. up to you. Um, perfect. Actually, you know what? My, my apologies, Marie. My apologies. We're going to, I just realized something as you're doing that. Maybe I can be like counting the cards and seeing how many. So take the ones you just dealt, put them back on top. 
And let's do perfect. this instead of, yeah, right there. That's perfect. And instead of that, Marie, I'm going to invite you to lift up a small portion of cards. Okay. Excellent. Turn them over and put them back on top. Beautifully done, Marie. Uh, in fact, this time, I'm going to invite you to go even further, Marie. Reach deeper into the deck, lift up even more cards, and then you'll turn those over. Awesome. And put them back, and, and yeah, turn them all the way over and put them back on top. Beautifully yeah. done, Marie. Cool, cool, cool. And let's <laughs> review, shall we, Marie? I didn't like pay you 50 bucks uh, and tell you uh, where to cut those, right? Uh, and you don't, now, if you had dealt down, I might've known the, the number of cards where that cut happened, uh, but I can't even know that this way. And you don't even know that this way. Uh, Marie, uh, here's what I'd like you to do. I'd like you, we've created this awful mess of your cards. I'd like you to go through the face up cards and the spot that you cut at is that first face down card, Marie. I'd like you to, yeah, you can just spread them and take that first face down card. Don't look at it. Don't let anybody in the room see it. Uh, so it's the first face down one. It's the one that's got the cactus showing. Perfect. Um, mm -hmm. Marie, if you would take that, hold it against yourself. Like it's a, uh, like it's a precious secret there, Marie. Uh, and you don't know what that card is, right? Do I know? I don't know what it is. You don't know what it, oh, that's awesome. That's awesome. So here's what we're going to do, Marie. Uh, if I were to shuffle the cards right here at this moment, uh, in my hands on my side of the screen, uh, that might be kind of suspicious. So we've got a, a system here for shuffling these cards that's going to be very, very random. And we have a magic wand, Marie, a very eccentric magic wand. Here we okay. go, Marie. Uh, just hold it close to yourself. You don't even know what that card is. Here we go, guys. Let's no. see what we can do. I have one card here on the tip of my blade that the knife found, Marie. The card that my knife found is the nine of diamonds. For the very, now Marie doesn't even know what this card is. Uh, Marie, yeah. if you want to tilt the camera up for us, just kind of tilt the, tilt the, uh, the, the uh, perfect so we can see your beautiful face. And Marie, for the very first time, what is the card that you've been holding against yourself? Oh my God. Oh my God, a nine of diamonds. That is oh. amazing. <laughs> Wow. Thank you so much, Marie. You were incredible. Guys, give her give her the waving. Yeah. Hand. We'll give her the oh, uh, look you at are that. Awesome. This is a magic I, grave. Oh, I appreciate it. Oh, oh there they are. There they are. That's that's obnoxious. That's so pretentious. Uh my my bring up the screen of you guys. Um, hey, it has been a genuine oh, pleasure good. sharing some of my time with you guys. I hope oh, you guys had as much God. fun with me as I did with you. Have a great rest of the happy hour. I'm gonna turn it over to our amazing host. Alan. Thank Alan. you. Thank you. Wow. Let's give him a hand. That was pretty cool. Very cool. Thank you, Nate. Thank you. That was fun. That was fun. Thank you for watching. If you would like to participate on our weekly happy hour show, you can find a link to sign up in the description below. Also, please consider subscribing to my channel by clicking right here and don't forget to click on the bell so you are notified every time we publish new videos. To watch the next episode of the happy hour, go ahead and click here.